Hey guys, what is up? This is Dwarzio57 and welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the top 3 removed items in Terraria. So these were all items that were added into the game and then for whatever reason the developers decided to take them out. Sometimes it had to do with copyright reasons or maybe the item just didn't work. But yeah, all these items were in the game and then removed later on. So I'm going to be showing you guys 3 of those items in this video. Coming in at number 3 is the Soul Scythe. So this is a pretty distinct looking weapon. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this before. I'm gonna put the stats on the screen right now just so you guys can check them out. The Soul Scythe was introduced in the 1.2 update. This item was actually never obtainable and what that means is that you can never get this through normal gameplay. So you could only get this item through inventory editing or mods. This actually was referenced to a different show like an anime or something like that. And that was the reason why this was actually removed in the 1.2.2 update. It says on the wiki that it was removed due to copyright reasons. So it's possible that the show just didn't want the item in the game so they decided to take it down. When they removed the soul scythe, they actually erased it completely from the game code. If you guys don't know, every item has an item ID, and they erased the item ID for the soul scythe, and they replaced it with the red potion. So if you tried to inventory edit it back, you'd only get the red potion um, because it's been completely removed from the game. So yeah, it's now completely removed, and no one can get it anymore, uh, even through hacks and mods and stuff like that. But it was a great weapon, a lot of people liked it, and it still is one of the better weapons that were removed. In number 2 we have the Ice Morn. This item was also introduced in 1.2 and it was also impossible to obtain just like the Soul Scythe. It was removed in 1.2.4 for actually multiple reasons. One of the reasons was because it was never usable. It actually didn't have any stats because um, I guess the developers just didn't give it any stats. So even though you could get it um, through inventory editing and you could like use it and it had like some animations and stuff like that, it never had any stats. So if you tried to like kill an enemy with it, it wouldn't do anything because the game just like didn't let it. It didn't have any damage, it didn't have any knockback or anything like that. Like that. If you look on the wiki, there actually are stats for this weapon now, but I can only assume that those were added after it was removed because it says on the wiki that it had no stats when it was in the game. And the second reason that it was removed was because it was actually a reference to a Warcraft series by Blizzard Entertainment. Apparently, they made the Ice Morn look really similar to a sword that was in the series, so I'm pretty sure that Blizzard didn't like the item in the game. Um, so, yeah, that's another reason why the developers decided to take it out. So, the Ice Morn was basically removed from the game for the same reasons that the Soul Scythe was. So, yeah, most of these items were actually in reference to something else, so that's mainly why the developers decided to take these items out of the game. Coming in at number 1 is the Mysterious Package, and this item was actually meant to be a mobile exclusive item. As you guys can see, it's a pet summoner. It's a basically a box that looks a lot similar to an Amazon box, and when you use it, it summons a pet drone. The reason why they put this in the game was because they wanted to have an exclusive item that would um, only be available to those who bought Terraria on an Amazon device. Um, so if you bought Terraria on like an Amazon tablet, you should have been able to get this item for a short amount of time. The Mysterious Package summons a pet drone because they wanted to make a reference to the Amazon Prime Air, which was announced around the time that the item was made. There is actually an item similar to this on Android. It summons a pet Android and I'll probably put that on the screen right now but it is really similar just um, the mysterious package is for Amazon and the Android is for Android devices obviously. But that's basically it for this list. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'm planning to make more of these videos in the future like top five items and stuff like that. Um, so if you guys want me to make a list um, drop a comment down below and I'll try to read those. But that's it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like if you did and I'll see you guys in the next one.